I find, as I mentioned, this to be the best size for me, being 5'6", having the body shape that I have, the body type that I have. The only thing that stays consistent is the grind. Keep on grinding. What is up, everybody? Very, very happy and excited to be back today. I hope that everyone's doing very, very well. Had a fantastic request from one of the fantastic viewers of this channel, and I really mean that. I, I gotta say, you guys have really shown me so much love ever since I've come out with this channel. It means so much. The, the genuine love that's shown on this channel is, I, I can't even describe it to you. As you guys might know, I have another channel. It's a bodybuilding channel. But I gotta say, I gotta be honest when I say that I have not seen more love on that channel than on this one. I don't know why, maybe it's just the particular niche that we're talking about, the jewelry compared to the bodybuilding, I don't know what it is. All I know is that while I do see love on that channel, I haven't seen the type of love that I've seen on this channel. So thank you all very much. My buddy Rich asked me a while ago to do a review in regards to an 18 inch, what he referred to as a choker. I think we can all kind of refer to that as a choker. Um, some people even go 16 inch depending on your neck size, you know what I mean? But he, he wanted to see the differences between an 18 inch, a 20 inch, and a 22 inch chain. Now he didn't specify which chain this was, and if he did, Rich, I apologize. Please let me know if I can do another one of these videos. And I also want to apologize that it's taken so, so long for me to get this video out. I lost a lot of my requests that you guys sent me. I'm trying to hit back whatever requests I was able to find. I'm trying to do them in order, but that's a little bit hard. If you think I might have missed your request, hit me back, let me know in the comments, and I will try to get to that request as soon as possible. Thank you guys again for your patience. Rich, personally, I'd like to thank you and, uh, for your patience and your kind words that you always show to me, which I don't deserve. Let's get into this today. All right, so what we're gonna be looking at today is a nine millimeter Miami Cuban link. We're gonna be looking at it from 18 inches, right? We're gonna go 12 feet away because that's what we do on this channel. We take jewelry back in case you're not familiar, 12 feet to give you guys a real honest, real world look at what this jewelry is gonna look like on you. Again, I wasn't asked to do any particular millimeter, but I have had subscribers in the past say, Joe, what's the difference between shorter chains and thicker millimeters? What do I do? What's too thick to go too short with? I don't know if that makes sense, but I think you guys know what I'm talking about. We're gonna be getting into that in the next video, okay? We're gonna be looking at some chains all at the same millimeters at different lengths to show you how the length really equates to the thickness of the chain that you're looking at, all right? So let's take, take this close, back. show you this nine millimeter here, just to give you an idea of what this looks like up close. Then you're gonna see this nine millimeter from 12 feet away at an 18, a 20, and a 22 inch length. All right, so this was what Rich referred to as a choker. Now, if you got even shorter, I have a very thin neck, okay? It's always been something that I haven't really liked. It's always really cool to see, you know, a guy walking around with a thicker neck, like you see wrestlers on TV and stuff like that. I've exercised my neck, you know, used, you know, weight bands on it and stuff. I've even demonstrated that on my bodybuilding channel. It's very, very tough. Uh, spot for me to, you know, body build with my neck. So depending on your neck size, this is going to depend on, you know, your style and your neck size, what you might want to do. Personally, I can even go to a 16 inch, which would probably be about here. And at that point, I would call it a real life choker. This thing's hanging around your neck. At 18 inches, however, which is what he asked to see, this is not, I mean, it, I guess, depending on your neck size, it's, it, it'll be a choker. But on me, as you can see, this is not really a choker. I guess it depends on how you define choker. But this is an 18 inch, nine millimeter. Let's take this 12 feet away to show you guys what this will look like on you in real life if you decide to do an 18. Now remember, I'm five foot six. I'm 155 pounds as of today. And I am 12 feet away. So depending on your size, this 18 inch may or may not be what you want to go for. My particular go-to chain that I feel comfortable with being five foot six is a 20 inch. That's my usual everyday size. No matter what I'm wearing, that's what I like. Let's throw on that 20 inch. 
All right, now this is the 20 inch, falls right below the collarbone. Here's my collarbone, falls below the collarbone. The 18 inch was approximately, probably just above my collarbone. I find, as I mentioned, this to be the best size for me, being 5'6", having the body shape that I have, the body type that I have. Take this 12 feet back to show you guys what that'll look like from 12 feet away, giving you a real life look, best as we can on camera, all right? Personally, I like this size because, I mean, this is a nine millimeter. I'm not rocking a nine millimeter every single day, but even at a 10 millimeter, the 20 inch for my particular size, I think it falls just good enough. The 20 inch length allows me to body build in it, run around in it, and it's not getting too crazy. It's not hanging too low. I can sleep in it. I'm not getting it tangled around my arms, nothing like that. Um, it is a little bit tight as far as maybe a pendant might go. Maybe, I would say personally a 22 inch with a pendant, but that's another video. And this, my friends, is the 22 inch hanging around the neck. Let's take this a little bit further back, give you guys a look. Now, when I say I personally like 20 inches, does that mean that you should feel a little weird if you don't like 20 inches? No way, absolutely not. There's a lot of people who go for the 22 inch length. That's just personally for me. I like that length, I feel comfortable in it. And again, it suits my lifestyle. I sleep with my chains on all the time. I like for them to be a certain length. And just from my particular, you know, the way I move, the way I walk around, the me, for Joe, right? For Joe, I find that 20 inches is great. If you are the same size as me, but you like the 22, nothing wrong with that. As long as you enjoy it and you want to rock it, you should rock it, definitely. So this was the 22 inch. I hope this video helped. Looking forward to getting some great content out for you guys. Forgive me again for being a little bit scarce these days. I'm running the two channels, so that's getting busy. I'm doing a couple of side hustles that I look forward to talking to you guys about in the future. And it's just, life's been really busy with family, medical problems that have been popping up lately, but hopefully things calm down soon and I can give you guys the, the attention that I want to give you and you guys deserve. Thank you all for the support that you show on this channel. Be safe. Catch you guys at the next video.